Parliament arson and terrorism accused Zandele Mafe will no longer be applying for bail tomorrow. And this is, of course, because he's contracted COVID-19 and is still in isolation. This means his lawyers were unable to consult with him this week. The state has also compiled a new charge sheet which has left Mafe's lawyers frustrated. Our senior reporter Aisha Ismail has more. Earlier this week, Zandile Mafe won his urgent court application to be released from Falkenberg Psychiatric Hospital. Judge President John Clope ruled that Mafe's referral to Falkenberg was unlawful and procedurally flawed. Mafe's lawyers confirmed the bail application was moved due to his COVID-19 status, but said they were shocked that a new charge sheet has been compiled. The charge sheet came with completely a new charge which was uh, dropped at some stage, a charge of house breaking with the intent to, to, to steal. You, you still remember that charge. But now it came with a charge of house breaking with the intention to commit terrorism and arson. Now it changed absolutely uh, the charge completely. Now. It makes it impossible to simply take Mr. Mafe to a witness stand and give evidence on a charge which he did not even, uh, uh, he was not even aware about it. So we could not go during the weekend consult with him because it's not safe to do so. Remember that eight uh, period, eight day period will end on Saturday. Godla says they need a thorough consultation with Mafe regarding the new charge sheet to compile a detailed affidavit. The NPA confirmed the changes to the charge sheet. The accused is now charged with housebreaking with intent to commit terrorism and arson. Arson, terrorism and theft. The changes came after Advocate Mervyn Menigo, who is the leading prosecutor in the matter, had started the docket afresh further consulted with the investigating officer and felt that the charges needed to be reformulated. But Godla maintains the state has the wrong man and that Mafe will plead not guilty. Mr. Mafe is innocent. Mr. Mafe does not have any interest to touch the parliament. It's not Mr. Mafe and there is no human being in his or her right mind who would go commit a crime then a place after that he would go within a certain proximity and fall asleep yet the place is burning the new bail application is scheduled to take place next saturday which the state will oppose aisha ismail cape town